Hi guys and welcome to my channel. As you can already see, today is all about VIP. I am in Uganda and thank you so much Speak Apartments for giving me the chance to sit here with the lovely Irene Tale. How are you Irene? I'm alright, how are you doing? I'm good my love. Very pleased to meet you. Oh, pleased to meet you too. And it's a blessing my sister. So it's been such a long day for us. Um, we're in Kampala, Uganda. If you haven't heard the news yet, Irene Tale is the first Ugandan act to be signed by Universal Music um, Group. And she's signed under Universal Music Nigeria team. And um, we made the announcement. I mean, it's a really great moment for Ugandan music industry, East Africa music industry um, at large. And I would say women in entertainment. So congratulations, Irene. How does it feel? Um, I'm very happy and I'm very blessed, you know, and I'm so, so grateful and so thankful to God, you know, for aligning everything for me right now in this particular moment. Because, I mean, as a woman, you know, in the industry, as a female singer, sometimes it's not easy. You know, sometimes you feel like quitting and giving up. But then it's amazing how God works and also the kind of team that I have, my sister that I work with and also a very good friend that we also work with called Kim, you know. So my team also has helped me so, so much. You know, I can't even sit here and say, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I can sing, I can, I can play the guitar, yeah. So they signed me, you know. It's, it's, a, it's a collective work, yeah, yeah. So I'm really grateful. I'm really happy and just enjoying the moment, but also happy about the work and also excited about more work. Okay. Yeah. So a lot of people watching at home really wonder, um, you know, what, what goes on behind the scenes or what does it mean to get signing to such a big record label? If there's anything you can disclose, um, maybe tell us what does this mean for you as an artist, as a professional uh, brand? Um, for me, it's... The number one thing is the opportunities that come along with it, you know, because it, it helps you to expand, you know, it helps you to meet new people, it helps you to, um, to work with people that you never thought you'd work with. Um, in the past, I would only work with producers here, for example, I would only work with videographers here, I would only, I would even say only get interviewed by people in the media here, but see now we are seated here together, do you understand? So it is more opportunities, it's a lot of learning, it's a lot of growth. And as an artist, this is what we need, you know, you need to be able to, to travel and record a song with a different producer from another country and just pick that vibe and see, basically it even grows your talent. So it's, it's really amazing. And you have a new record that just came out and it's called Nyamba, which from, <laughs> from my country means farting, but that's not what um, she meant in the song. So on Twitter, somebody, was, somebody tweeted and said, Nyamba means farting, and I was like, okay, <laughs> it's okay, what can I do? <laughs> yeah, I've learned that today. I would never have thought in a million years, you know, that Nyamba means farting in Kiswahili, right? No, but seriously, um, in Luganda, it means help me, and this is a love song. Um, it's about, a wom I sang about... Any woman that can be in a relationship and you feel like your partner maybe is looking around, looking elsewhere, you know. So this song is mainly about, about telling your lover, um, don't leave me. You know, sometimes you need to talk like that. You know, don't leave me, please stay with me, you know. I'm, everything that you feel you're looking out for, I have it right here. And my love is real, my love is pure. So really, that's what the record is about. But also, you can dance to it, and you can also blast it in your earphones. It's, it's an amazing song, and I hope that people really enjoy it and love it so much, because it came from a place of love right here. <laughs> okay, a lot of your fans, and especially those in Uganda, you know, want to know and have been asking if you relocated to Nigeria. And with the new signing, does it mean that um, your sound is going to change and maybe have more of the Afrobeats? Um, or are you going to give up a part of yourself to appeal to the larger audience? No, I'm not definitely not giving up any part of myself. If there's anything I'm giving up, it's probably the, the bad that I'm, still, that I'm still working on, just like any other human being. But um, I'm not moving to Nigeria, you know. I simply travel there to work, to record, because um, the EP that's going to come out later in the year, most of it have, have recorded it in Nigeria. So I've been 
traveling to Nigeria quite a lot. So I think people thought, oh, maybe she's moving. Or oh, now with the announcement, they might think, oh, she's relocating. But no, 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 I'm still Irene Tale, very Ugandan, you know, and I'm still going to, I'm just bettering my art, you know, bettering my sound. I'm not trying to copy any Nigerian sound. I'm just fusing it with what I know as a musician. So it's, it's Afrobeat and, you know, Afrobeat is African music. Yeah. So what message do you want to give um, to artists watching you across East Africa especially? Because this signing is something um, legendary for the um, region and hopefully many other signings will come. Um, and a lot of artists want support and very few can get signed to such labels. You know? So when you look back at your journey and how you got here, you know, what advice can you give the person watching and maybe hoping that, I hope that's me one day. Okay, um, firstly you really have to believe in yourself. You know, it sounds very simple. Believe in the gift that God gave you and work on your craft. You know, take it easy. Sometimes you feel like, oh, I should be here. Maybe I'm 27. Why am I on this level? I should be singing on this festival stage or whatever. But the truth of the matter is everything will eventually happen. You know, if you continue doing what you're supposed to do. So my thing is do not give up. Keep pressing on and keep doing what you're supposed to be doing. The rest you just leave to God. Hey, you've heard that. <laughs> I have <It's> too long. <laughs> After this, I have nothing else to say. So you work hard, you know, keep the spirit up, the rest leave to God. From me and my team, I just want to say congratulations to you. It's been such an honor to meet and work with you. And um, I hope that we keep rising, we keep pushing uh, brand Irene Tale into the world and not just Africa. You know, bless your talent. And um, thank you guys for watching. So this is Irene Tale. Please check out her new music. It's called Help Me by Irene Tale. Help Me Brackets Nyamba. <laughs> On all digital platforms, let's keep supporting this dope music. Um, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Next week I'll be hanging out with another super celebrity. Bye.